Well, I'm back with another video. This time it's Rob McEachern's 1994 <coughs> Venable Racing F-150 from the 1994 Exhibition Races that the NASCAR Camping World Truck Series ran under the name the NASCAR Super Truck Series by Craftsman. But Craftsman didn't come till 95. Well, you can see the truck here comes from, with three parts like every other racing champions diecast. You have the base, the actual truck, and the card. Now, the base, when I got this, this was a problem with all the gold ones, but the tires would, I guess, had melted on due to all the years and the heat, so for only the gold base trucks I got had that issue, but let's move the truck and uh, let's take a look at the car. Uh, Rob McCachron, he currently runs the Lucas Oil Off-Road Racing Series, which is dirt trucks. Um, I know because it airs on CBS, he drives the 21 in Pro 4 and Pro 2, I believe. There's a racing championship logo, his signature, name, truck series, and a picture of him. On the back, I don't know why they give you a bunch of his personal info, I guess. But you got his name. Got where he was from. from. You got his birthday. He's like 50, amazingly, and his signature in even bigger detail. Um, let's just attach this. And excuse me, I'm going to probably get like OCD or something if I don't put this on. Well, you know, screw it. Let's okay. Let's look at the truck. It's a pure white truck. Uh, okay. Hmm. The grill is silver. You have the Ford logo on the hood. You have black uh, headlights on the side. Uh, you have the NASCAR race car logo. You have Jane E. Simpson, Moroso. Featherlight all filled, uh, Featherlight trailers, Champion, Edelbrock, Corolla, four trucks, Vanville Racing, Sunoco, and one sec. Yeah. Hurst, uh, Shifters, Motor Racing Design, and this actually says NASCAR Super Truck. Goodyear, 76, you have white. Outline Goodyear tires. In the back, <clears throat> you have performance friction carbon uh, carbon metallic on there. Paint scheme I really like the 12. You got Craftsman on there. His name 12. Yeah. You have a white stripe going down the bottom. Then you have the blue on the top. The red, white, and blue contrasts perfectly, and it's patriotic, I guess you could say. America. Yeah. So this is the first of a good amount of truck videos you'll be seeing in the next couple weeks. Um, I'm also going to be start working on a Martinsville track, but I haven't because I have no clue where to start. Um, see you guys next week with another video.